The legacy of Elvis Presley hailed as the king of rock and roll may be a source of pride for his fans, but for his niece, Riley Keough, it is a heavy burden to bear. Contrary to popular belief, owning the heritage of such a renowned figure like Elvis Presley is not a privilege, but rather a challenge that Riley has had to endure. She has navigated through tumultuous family disputes over her grandfather's legacy and faced numerous struggles while being overshadowed by his towering presence. It has taken years of arduous effort for Riley to carve out her own path, independent of Elvis Presley's legacy. There are many interesting things you need to know about Riley Keough in this video. Let's get started. You may not believe it, but Riley Keough never took her relationship with Elvis Presley seriously. Although Riley Keough's lineage as Elvis Presley's granddaughter bestowed upon her a legacy of fame and musical heritage. Yet growing up, she grappled with the reality of never having known the legendary musician firsthand. Riley's childhood was devoid of direct interactions with her grandfather, and he remained a distant figure in her upbringing. This intentional distance from Elvis's larger-than-life persona was a conscious decision made by Riley's mother, Lisa Marie Presley. In a candid interview on The Oprah Winfrey Show in 2007, Lisa Marie revealed her desire to shield her children from the weight of their family's legacy ensuring they were free to pursue their own passions without feeling overshadowed by their grandfather's towering reputation. Instead of idolizing Elvis as a cultural icon, Riley was introduced to him through the lens of family, with photographs serving as a tangible connection to her grandfather's legacy. Lisa Marie's approach was grounded in a desire to provide her children with a sense of normalcy, allowing them to form their own identities independent of their famous lineage. Despite the emotional distance from her grandfather, Riley harbored a deep respect and admiration for Elvis's legacy. While she acknowledged his immense fame, she remained grounded in her own identity, unaffected by the weight of his renown. Riley embraced her heritage with pride, viewing her lineage as a fact of her existence rather than a burden to bear. However, Riley was determined to forge her own path in life, independent of her family's fame and fortune. From a young age, she exhibited a strong work ethic and a desire to carve out her own successes, driven by a desire for autonomy and self-reliance. Riley's determination to chart her own course in life reflected her resilience and determination to define herself on her own terms. Riley Keough has been in a bitter legal battle with Elvis Presley's wife, i.e., Priscilla Presley. The passing of Lisa Marie Presley, a significant figure in music history, and the daughter of the legendary Elvis Presley marked a profound moment for her family. However, what ensued following her death was a tangled web of familial discord and legal battles that threatened to tarnish her legacy. Lisa Marie's will, a document meant to delineate her wishes and preserve her estate, entrusted the responsibility of managing her affairs to her daughter, Riley Keough, and her son, Benjamin Keough. Together they were appointed as co-trustees, tasked with overseeing valuable assets like Graceland, the iconic mansion that stands as a symbol of Elvis's enduring legacy. Tragically, Benjamin's untimely death altered the dynamics of Lisa Marie's estate plan, leaving Riley as the sole trustee. This transition should have been a time of unity and support within the family as they navigated their grief and adjusted to their new roles. However, the tranquility was shattered when Lisa Marie's mother, Priscilla Presley, decided to contest her daughter's will mere days after her passing. Priscilla's contention stemmed from the alleged invalidity of an amendment to the trust, which removed her as a co-trustee and elevated Riley to sole trustee status. She claimed that she was not properly notified of this amendment, casting doubt on its legitimacy and igniting a legal battle that threatened to fracture the family further. The rift between Riley and Priscilla deepened as their relationship deteriorated reaching a point where communication between them nearly ceased altogether. 
For Riley, who harbored a desire to preserve her mother's legacy and foster familial harmony, the conflict was profoundly distressing. Despite Riley's efforts to maintain unity within the family, Priscilla's actions only served to exacerbate tensions. Riley, grappling with the loss of her brother and the burden of managing her mother's estate, found herself at odds with her grandmother's decision to contest the will. Moreover, Riley was unfairly targeted when reports surfaced alleging that she barred Priscilla from setting foot inside Graceland, further fueling the flames of discord. While these claims incited anger and resentment, they were vehemently denied by sources close to the situation, underscoring the complexity and sensitivity of the ongoing feud. The resolution of the legal battle over Lisa Marie Presley's estate marked a turning point for her family, albeit one fraught with financial challenges and emotional strain. After months of contentious negotiations, Riley Keough and Priscilla Presley reached a settlement in May 2023, bringing an end to their legal dispute. Under the terms of the agreement, Riley would assume the sole trustee role for her mother's estate, while Priscilla would transition into an advisory position, ensuring her continued involvement in matters concerning Graceland, the cherished estate that held profound significance for the Presley family. The settlement also included provisions for Priscilla's financial well-being, with reports indicating that she was to receive a substantial sum of $1 million up front, followed by annual payments of $100,000 for the next decade. This arrangement aimed to provide Priscilla with financial security while honoring her long-standing connection to Graceland and her commitment to preserving its legacy. In her interview with Vanity Fair in August 2023, Riley candidly discussed the turbulent legal battle and expressed relief that a resolution had been reached. Despite the upheaval caused by the dispute, she maintained that there was never a significant rift between her and Priscilla, challenging the media's portrayal of her grandmother. Riley emphasized Priscilla's genuine desire to safeguard Graceland, portraying her as a loving and protective figure within the family. Priscilla echoed Riley's sentiments, affirming that their relationship remained strong throughout the ordeal. In an interview with The Hollywood Reporter, she emphasized the positive nature of their bond, dispelling any notion of discord between them. With the settlement formalized by a judge in October 2023, Riley hoped for a sense of closure and stability. However, her financial troubles persisted, as revealed by reports of a substantial tax lien issued against her by the California Franchise Tax Board. The burden of unpaid taxes totaling over $68,000 added to the challenges she faced in managing her late mother's affairs. Additionally, Riley grappled with the daunting task of settling Lisa Marie's outstanding debts, including a significant loan balance owed to Barclays Bank. Beyond being thrust into the role of managing her mother's estate, Riley found herself shouldering a greater sense of duty towards her younger half-siblings, Harper and Finley Lockwood, whom Lisa Marie shared with her ex-husband, Michael Lockwood. Reports indicated that Riley's bond with Harper and Finley grew stronger in the wake of their mother's death, as she stepped up to provide support and stability during a tumultuous time. With empathy born from her own experiences of loss, Riley endeavored to be a source of strength for her sisters, going above and beyond to ensure their well-being. From treating them to outings like Taylor Swift concerts and shopping trips to facilitating their access to therapy, Riley demonstrated her unwavering commitment to nurturing her sisters through their grief. Despite the challenges that accompanied their newfound responsibilities, Riley remained steadfast in her determination to remain a constant presence in Harper and Finley's lives. Concerns about maintaining her connection with them surfaced in the aftermath of Lisa Marie's passing, prompting Riley to express her desire to remain an integral part of her sister's upbringing. However, navigating this newfound role was not without its complexities, especially in light of Riley's strained relationship with Michael Lockwood, the twins' father. Despite any interpersonal challenges, Riley's protective instincts kicked into high gear, 
driving her to fiercely advocate for her sister's well-being and serve as a steadfast pillar of support in their lives. Riley's bond with Harper and Finley held a special significance for her, distinct from her relationship with her late brother. Describing her dynamic with the twins as more maternal and caretaker-oriented, Riley emphasized the depth of her commitment to guiding and nurturing them through life's challenges. Amidst her efforts to provide solace and stability to her sisters, Riley also embarked on her own journey of motherhood, adding another layer of complexity to her responsibilities. Balancing the demands of caring for her newborn child while tending to the needs of her grieving family underscored the depth of Riley's resilience and capacity for love. In 2022, when she and her husband embarked on the path of parenthood, they made the decision to utilize a surrogate due to Riley's battle with Lyme disease. This debilitating illness had cast a shadow over Riley's life, making the prospect of pregnancy and childbirth physically daunting. Despite the hurdles posed by her health condition, Riley and her husband welcomed their daughter with open arms, naming her Tupelo as a homage to the birthplace of Elvis Presley, a nod to their rich family heritage. However, as Riley navigated the joys and responsibilities of motherhood, her battle with Lyme disease persisted, casting a pall over her daily life. In 2023, Riley spoke candidly to Vanity Fair about her ongoing struggle with Lyme disease, revealing her decision to seek treatment at a specialized facility in Switzerland. Describing the facility as a haven for holistic healing, Riley expressed hope in the innovative treatments it offered, including therapies not yet available in the United States. Despite her reluctance to divulge the specifics of her symptoms, Riley's previous remarks shed light on the profound impact of Lyme disease on her daily life. Basic tasks like getting out of bed and going for a walk posed significant challenges, underscoring the severity of her condition. The potential long-term ramifications of Lyme disease, ranging from debilitating headaches to neurological complications, painted a grim picture of the toll it could take on Riley's health. Yet, despite these daunting prospects, Riley remained determined not to let her illness define her. Embracing her identity as a self-professed workaholic, Riley found solace in her relentless pursuit of her passions and commitments. However, she also recognized the importance of prioritizing her mental well-being, acknowledging the toll that her tumultuous life experiences had taken on her psyche. As she embarked on her journey of healing at the treatment center in Switzerland, Riley found herself at a crossroads, grappling with the dual challenges of managing her physical health and nurturing her mental resilience. It has been revealed that Riley Keough now faces the prospect of losing Graceland. Her stewardship of Graceland, the hallowed grounds that serve as a testament to her grandfather Elvis Presley's enduring legacy, was both a privilege and a burden. As the custodian of this iconic estate, Riley embraced her role with unwavering dedication, striving to honor her family's heritage and preserve the memory of the legendary musician. In 2023, Riley took a significant step in upholding her grandfather's legacy by hosting a televised holiday special titled Christmas at Graceland. The event, held at Elvis Presley's beloved home, showcased the timeless charm and festive spirit that defined the king of rock and roll's legacy. Despite the joyous occasion, Riley revealed the bittersweet reality of spending time at Graceland in a Vanity Fair interview acknowledging the profound sadness that permeated the estate, now serving as the final resting place for many members of her family. Yet, despite the emotional weight that Graceland held for her, Riley remained steadfast in her commitment to preserving its legacy. When the estate faced the threat of foreclosure in 2024, Riley refused to surrender without a fight. Nossany Investments and Private Lending LLC claimed that Lisa Marie Presley had used Graceland as collateral for a substantial loan, prompting the scheduling of a foreclosure sale. In response, Riley filed a complaint, alleging forgery and challenging the legitimacy of Nossany Investments 
as a legitimate entity. The legal battle that ensued was fraught with tension and uncertainty, with Riley's determination to protect Graceland pitted against the looming threat of losing her family's cherished estate. However, her resolve remained unshakable bolstered by a steely determination to safeguard her grandfather's legacy at all costs. Despite the turmoil and adversity she faced, Riley drew strength from within, embodying the resilience and fortitude that defined her character. In a poignant reflection on her journey, she likened herself to Kelly Clarkson's anthem, Stronger, acknowledging the pain and loss she had endured while celebrating the resilience and growth that arose from adversity. There is a truth that despite growing up removed from the grandeur of Elvis Presley's legacy, Riley cherished the grounded perspective instilled by her father, which emphasized the importance of humility and authenticity. However, Riley's familial ties to the Presleys remained strong, fostering a deep sense of connection with her mother, Lisa Marie Presley, and the extended family. The bond between mother and daughter was palpable, evident in the heartfelt tribute Riley penned for Lisa Marie's memorial. In A Letter to My Mama, read by her husband, Riley expressed profound gratitude for her mother's unwavering love and guidance, reflecting on their 33 years together with deep affection and appreciation. Lisa Marie, in turn, took immense pride in her daughter's accomplishments as an actor, recognizing Riley's talent and resilience. Despite the pressures of fame, Lisa Marie allowed Riley to pursue acting on her own terms, a testament to her pragmatism and respect for her daughter's autonomy. Through her mother and the broader Presley family, Riley gradually came to embrace her connection to Elvis, recognizing the indelible mark he left on their lives and legacy. This realization was underscored by Riley's emotional reaction to Baz Luhrmann's 2022 biopic, Elvis, which delved into the tumultuous era of the king's life. In addition, Riley undertook the monumental task of completing Lisa Marie Presley's unfinished memoir, ensuring that her mother's voice would resonate with readers long after her passing. The memoir, slated for release in October 2024, offered a rare glimpse into Lisa Marie's innermost thoughts and experiences, shedding light on the woman behind the iconic persona. For Riley, the project was a labor of love, an opportunity to honor her mother's memory and share her untold story with the world. In a heartfelt statement shared via deadline, Riley reflected on the privilege of delving into her mother's narrative, acknowledging the profound impact of their intimate bond. Few people had the opportunity to know who my mom really was, other than being Elvis's daughter, she remarked. I was lucky to have had that opportunity. For Riley, the process of preparing her mother's autobiography for publication was both a privilege and a poignant reminder of their shared history. As she sifted through Lisa Marie's words, Riley unearthed moments of vulnerability and honesty, illuminating facets of her mother's personality that were previously unknown to the public. The prospect of sharing Lisa Marie's story with readers filled Riley with a mix of excitement and melancholy. Working on preparing her autobiography for publication has been a privilege, albeit a bittersweet one, she confessed. Yet, amidst the sorrow, there was a glimmer of hope, a hope that through her mother's words, readers would come to love and appreciate Lisa Marie as deeply as she did. Riley Keough's remarkable resilience and unwavering sense of responsibility in the face of tragedy resonated deeply within the Presley family, earning her newfound admiration and respect from her relatives. As the family grappled with the profound loss of Lisa Marie Presley, Riley's strength and courage emerged as a guiding light, instilling a sense of awe and reverence among her loved ones. In an interview with Us Weekly, an insider shed light on the profound impact of Riley's steadfast presence during their time of mourning. Describing her as a born leader, the insider emphasized Riley's remarkable ability to maintain balance and level-headedness amidst the chaos of grief. 
Riley's calm demeanor and astute judgment made her a trusted confidant and source of support for her family, providing them with the reassurance that they could rely on her to make sound decisions during moments of uncertainty. The admiration for Riley's resilience extended beyond her immediate family circle, resonating with those who knew and loved Lisa Marie. As the insider revealed, Lisa Marie held Riley in the highest regard, viewing her daughter as a steadfast rock and source of strength throughout their shared experiences. In the wake of Lisa Marie's passing, the depth of their bond became even more apparent, underscoring Riley's unwavering commitment to her family, even in the face of unimaginable loss. You might not know this, Lisa Marie Presley, despite being the daughter of the legendary Elvis Presley, faced her own set of challenges and struggles throughout her life. Her journey was marked by adversity, characterized by a complex interplay of triumphs and tribulations that shaped her into the resilient and multifaceted woman she was. In the shadow of her father's towering legacy, Lisa Marie grappled with the weight of expectations and the relentless scrutiny of the public eye. Despite her privileged upbringing, she navigated a path fraught with obstacles, grappling with personal demons and navigating the complexities of fame and fortune. Fame. Lisa Marie's struggles with addiction and the dissolution of four marriages underscored the tumultuous nature of her personal life. Despite the facade of glamour and success, she grappled with inner turmoil and emotional upheaval, confronting her demons with courage and resilience. Yet amidst the trials and tribulations, Lisa Marie exuded a sense of strength and determination that was truly awe-inspiring. She was a woman who refused to be defined by her setbacks, instead forging ahead with unwavering resolve and a fierce sense of independence. For Riley Keough, Lisa Marie's daughter, her mother's resilience and unwavering authenticity served as a guiding light and a source of inspiration. In preparing for her role in Daisy Jones and the Six, Riley drew upon her mother's indomitable spirit. Embracing the ethos of doing one's own thing and marching to the beat of one's own drum. In a poignant reflection, Riley acknowledged the profound influence her mother had on her life and career. I was raised by somebody who did their own thing and didn't really care what other people thought, she remarked in an interview with People. Lisa Marie's unwavering commitment to authenticity and self-expression resonated deeply with Riley shaping her approach to both her personal and professional endeavors. What do you think about the burden Riley Keough has to shoulder as the grandchild of Elvis Presley and the child of Lisa Marie? Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this and see you in the next videos. Goodbye!